it seems like that the early church fathers, their views on the end of things, you know, I just showed you a few places, but there's many, that puts them in opposition to the doctrine Paul taught. So you think of this. Why do the early church fathers and all their writings, why did they seem to point people away from Paul? Why? Well, you know, because you look and we've seen the examples, a lot of their stuff disagrees with Paul. Why would they do that? That's a good question. The answer to that question is, they didn't. They already had turned away. They didn't write their writings in a fashion where they were trying to manipulate people to turn from Paul's writings. They themselves had already turned their backs on Paul before they started writing. How do I know that? Oh, there's our church fathers. You're like that. Well, Paul, while he was still alive, told us, all the churchians have turned away from me. This thou knowest, that they which are in Asia be turned away from me, of whom are Phygelus and Hermogenes. That's the milkman. I, I understand you've got to call out bad doctrine, but I just think it's wrong to name names. You shouldn't name names. Oh. What do you do with an apostle that does that? <laughs> While he was still alive, everybody had already turned their back on Paul and gone a different direction. What about this one? He's warning again. Second Timothy again. Their word will eat us doth a canker, of whom is Hymenaeus and Philetus. I hate those name namers who concerning the truth have erred, what do they err about? That's the proper way to say that word, by the way. Most people err when they say err. Err. Uh. But what, are they, what, are the, what is their error? They're getting their eschatology wrong. In Paul's lifetime, everybody is turning their back on me and getting their eschatology wrong. So when we read the writings of the early church fathers that disagree with Paul, that wrongly combine the word of truth, we're reading the result of choices made here. They didn't turn you people away from Paul because they were trying to. They just didn't point to pe people to Paul because they'd already decided to turn their backs on him. That's why. And history is written by the winners, is it not? If you're going by numbers and popularity and public acceptance, are we the winners? So, is our choice to win? Is our choice to let God be true and every man a liar? Is our choice to believe our Bible or believe the denominations and the church fathers? For me, choosing long dead sinners over my preserved copy of God's Word, not going to do that. Not going to do it. <laughs> 